We bought Rathfinney, which was a working arable farm in 2010. Really after a, quite an extensive search, we spent about 18 months looking for the right piece of land in southern England to grow grapes and make sparkling wine. Sussex is the best place to be. We've got this great chalk soil, which is exactly the same as the soil in Champagne. It's the perfect place to grow grapes. Three years ago, English wine was a nice to have. Now it's become a must have, and it's now becoming its own individual category. You won't just have one English sparkling wine, you'll maybe have four or five different wines. Family is a huge part of our business. Every one of our children are involved in some way. But beyond that, we really think of our team at Rathfinney as being our extended family. Making wine is a labour of love. Everything we do is by hand, from the pruning, the tying back, the care throughout the year, and then the harvest, which is great fun. We're often late into October. The berries are really ripe. They have fantastic flavours and that enables us to make fantastic wines which are made over the winter in our winery and then we bottle the following late spring and into early summer. Having Princess Anne come and visit and open our buildings was a real stamp of royal approval. She really understood the importance of the industry to England and what was really lovely was she spent time with every single person. For me, one of the highlights of this year was going to the Savoy Hotel and being able to order our wine with an afternoon tea. In May, we served Raffini Blanc de Blanc uh, with afternoon tea and it was uh, probably one of the most successful afternoon tea we've ever done. When I've tasted the wine for the first time, I absolutely loved it. So, I mean, it tastes incredible. Obviously, at Le Gavroche, we've got quite an extensive wine list, but we only want to have the, the best. Being one of the first, having the Rasfini on the list will be outstanding, and there is no doubt that has to be here at Le Gavroche. And when you think of that, the first vintage with this quality, what it will be after five or 10 years experience, so, uh, wow, surprising. A lot of people will come and stay with us. We have rooms here at the Flint Barns. We are 45 minutes from Gatwick. We have this amazing countryside. We are near fantastic art galleries and places of interest to go to. I think people will come to Sussex in the same way that they go to Napa, they do the garden route in South Africa, that they go to Margaret River, and they'll make a holiday of it to come and see everything that Sussex has got to offer. We believe that in 20 years' time, people will look at Sussex as a fantastic region where they make some of the best sparkling wine in the world. <laughs>